Hey guys, Dr. Nikravon, damn man, driving me nuts all the time. How's everyone doing? Hope you guys are having a great day. So we're getting a lot of questions, a lot of topics about the thyroid, okay? This is about the thyroid nodule. So your thyroid is located right here and it looks just like this. You guys see this, this is a right lobe of the thyroid, the isthmus is the center, this is the left lobe, and this is your trachea all the way down here, and this is the cartilage rings that the thyroid sits on. So this is a normal thyroid. Now imagine if you have a thyroid nodule. What does that mean? Well, we take this off, and now we put this guy on here, and now let's take a look. That little red, red blip right there, that's a bump on the thyroid. Imagine a big mole, but it's actually a thyroid abnormality. You see, how do we find it? We find it on examination, so make sure your doctor examines your neck. And on top of it, how can you verify it if you think you have a thyroid nodule? You rely on a very sophisticated thyroid ultrasound machine that you do in the office. Once you do the thyroid nodule, you biopsy it. If it's large and it meets a special criteria, radiographic criteria. If it's benign, you may leave it alone and just follow it over time. Or if it's large or if it's bothering you, you have two options. You can radiofrequency it if it's becoming larger and it's benign. Or you can undergo surgery, which is his own risk. But I'm going to present to you a case of a lovely patient that presented with a large thyroid nodule located on the isthmus that was causing compressive episodes. So imagine this patient has an option to go to surgery, which means that she would have to take thyroid hormone the rest of her life, or she could radio frequency the procedure. And it's an amazing procedure that we offer in the office. It's minimally invasive in our surgical procedure suite and the patients get amazing results and I'm going to present you the findings. I hope you guys enjoy. As you can see here, there is a large thyroid nodule sitting on the isthmus. This nodule is causing compression. So her option was either to go surgery, lose her thyroid, take thyroid medicine, or undergo thyroid radiofrequency. This patient chose thyroid radiofrequency. Therefore, you can see four weeks post thyroid radiofrequency, this nodule has decreased substantially in size, which is wonderful. And then here, 22 weeks after follow-up, the nodule has further decreased even more. And here, 11 months later, you barely can see the nodule and the patient completely avoided surgery, has done great. Hope you guys enjoy.